I'm in a real rush. Sunset is in about half an hour's time. And I'm after a particular shot that I've um, taken before. I'll put the image up somewhere. And uh, I've acquired a new lens, a new longer lens as well as a wide angle. And now I can get where I want to. So, spur of the moment video. I do apologise for the higgledy piggledy and the high pitched voice. I really hope you enjoy this video and uh, come along. This is Summonies Beach. This is my local beach down at Bude. And uh, we're going down there to the sea pool, so let's get going. Right, I'm not gonna lie. This, uh, this shoot is not going to plan at all. Um, although I'm getting a nice shot, it's not the shot I wanted. There's a set of steps, say there. Um, I want to shoot some steps that are over there. You got barrel rock and the steps all in a line. I get down nice and low. I'm shooting across the water, the seaport water, and getting the steps and barrel rocking. That was the, that was the uh, aim. That was the shot I was after. Uh, I know the light is really flat, and this is, it is, I'm going for a minimal, minimal image, and just test out the sharpness of this. Um, it's a 70, 70 to 300 si uh, Sigma, and the steps are gone. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so what I'm doing now is I'm shooting at these steps, you just see them in the background there. I'm shooting low across the water and I'm just rattling off exposures because I'm getting people walking across the top of this edge here, that's the edge of the sea pool and then behind that is the sea. By getting down low I'm putting the edge of the sea pool as my horizon rather than obviously the horizon on the sea and it's creating a very minimal shot. Um, and there's a chap at the moment stood right in my shot. I'm doing a long exposure, about 25 seconds. With a six stop in and a Nissi polarizer. And he's taking a selfie of himself, so <laughs> if he stands there long enough, he's gonna be in my image. <laughs> but yeah. I don't know if I'd like that or not. <laughs> anyway, this is going to be quite a short video, I would say, due to the flat conditions and the fact that the steps are not here anymore. Bit of a bummer, really. But either way, it's a nice, it's a nice image. Do with him. Nah, he keeps moving. Anyway, here's the shot. Let me know what you think. It was, I don't know, I'm sorry, I can't tell you. It was an F9 anyway. 25 seconds, ISO 100 with a six star. I think it looks quite nice.
right, we are losing the light big time. Um, like I said to you earlier, this video is not going well. It's a lot darker than it looks on uh, on the video. I've come to the left hand side of the, the sea pool and I'm using a set of steps more to the left of the ones I wanted to shoot. Um, and I'm framing Barrow Rock in the distance, in the far distance. I'm um, still using the long lens. Um, I'm now F9, ISO 100, around four second exposure. And uh, just a polarizer. I I don't think I need any more than four seconds, really. Uh, I've got the V5 Nissi holder on. Landscape Nissi landscape polarizer. And that's it, around four seconds. Two second timer. Uh, I'm focusing on the steps. And in F9, I'm getting barrel rock in sharp focus as well. So yeah, I'm going to take a few more shots and um, I'll do a piece of camera in a minute to wrap this video up. Uh, I do apologise, it's a short one, but I just wanted to get out, I just had to get out and test this, uh, test this telephoto out. Now our barrel rock is uh, glowing, so I'm hoping maybe four seconds I'll push it to, push it to five seconds. You might get the light on top of Barrow Rock. Fingers crossed. <laughs> I'm still here. 15 seconds exposures now and I've just tweaked the composition slightly, I've just kicked the uh, kicked the dead space up a little bit, reduced the dead space at the bottom of the image, negative space sorry, just because I want options when I go home. It's always a good idea to um, if you think the composition could be tweaked slightly take the shot because if you get home and you haven't done that you wish you had. So yeah, same as before, just a longer exposure. 15 seconds F9 ISO 100. And I've just got rid of some of that negative space in the foreground. So that's your lot folks, I'm all done. From Summerlee's beach and the beauty pool. Uh, my last shot was taken, <laughs> taken uh, Barrow Rock, which is over there, and the steps. My other shots, my first two shots were taken from down here, uh, looking towards Crooklets Beach, which is technically uh, Middle Beach, and then you've got Crooklets Beach is the far beach. Um, like I said, but the steps that I wanted to shoot were around here. Um, not so much over here, because I can't get low down here, down over there. I couldn't get low low enough because I'm up on this, I'm up on this, uh, this edge of the sea pool. Um, over here, uh, there's a, um, a slope where the kiddies get in and out during the summer, and you can get down nice and low which will bring the horizon down with the edge of the sea pool and minimise the actual sea uh, which is what I was hoping for but I had to make a change of plan because them steps were missing I think I can test the sharpness of that, uh, this new lens it's a uh, Takita, uh, not Takina, it's a uh, Sigma 70-300 um, DX lens and I, from the back of the camera, I believe it's, it's quite sharp. The images look really good on the back of the uh, 
on the LCD on the back of the camera, but you never quite know. Uh, the histograms look good, so everything's everything's looking good, but you never quite know when you get home. Uh, so fingers crossed for some good shots. You would have seen them, obviously. I haven't in this moment in time. But uh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, I'm Photo Ninja. This is Bude Seaport on Summerlees Beach, and this was a typical Cornish sunset in uh, April. <laughs> Uh, no colour, uh, but then at the same time, like I said to you earlier, I was hoping for either really harsh light conditions for, and I'd turn it into a high contrast black and white, or dull misty conditions. It's definitely dull, the forecast mist, no mist. So, these are the conditions I was dealt with, these are the shots I've taken, so... Anyway, I'm going to go home and uh, get myself a beer, a sofa and watch Line of Duty with the missus. Uh, so I better crack on because it's almost 9 o'clock. I will see you next time on my next vlog. Don't know where that'll be. Um, it'll be somewhere local, I would say. Somewhere local. Right. I'm off. Like, share and subscribe. And I will see you on the next one. Ciao.